All right. So I just did my cardio. Uh, it was like 30 minutes. I kept this short. My calves are still screwed up. I don't know why. Anyway, got my uh, two cups of oatmeal here. Shit is hot as fuck, but I weighed it out this time. And 21 grams of honey is actually a fuck ton. But yeah, it's like 21 grams of carbs from the honey. And then 52 grams of carbs just from all the oatmeal. Um, I don't really, I put water in it. But I'm going to have some, um, some egg whites once I start eating this. Let me get to eating this. Pop on the old, uh, I'm thinking I need a Rich Piana video today. Because nobody makes egg whites look easier to eat than that guy. Like, Jesus Christ. He just sits there and... Alright, so I've got about half my oatmeal finished. Um, okay, this is smelling way better now. Um, I don't know what was in there. I swear, like pre-workout depending on what kind you get i guess it's probably like a worse smell than most protein that i've encountered so i'm putting you guys onto a little trick i learned it's not really a trick it's just kind of gross but um so this is just like the rise marshmallow flavor got this from walmart like a long time ago i just never I thought it would be like good to like make stuff with like ice cream or like pancakes or something, but not a big fan. It's kind of like just a super artificial vanilla flavor, but you know, still protein. Um, so what I like to do is I got my cup of egg whites. This is like seven servings, so. Uh, 75 grams of protein. Whoa. Wow, that was, you, you just witnessed me being horrible at math. No, it's 35 grams of protein because it's seven servings and each serving has five. Woo. I need to, I need to wake up, man. Anyway, what I like to do is I have my little cup here. Let me see if I can... Here, I'll just hold it up. Anyway, you take your protein shake. Oh, you mix a little bit in there, and then you just pretend, you know? This isn't egg whites, this is just a little bit extra of my protein shake. like a seamless transition what, what what egg whites this is just a protein shake good god yeah i picked that trick up because i used to like when i'd be running late for work especially in the summertime when my life was just a complete mess i would drink like six or seven eggs like whole eggs and i don't know if you've ever tried it but like the way they slip down your throat is not very pleasant. So I kind of had to trick myself with that. But the egg whites are easier because it's all like one consistency, I guess. It's not, you know, like, I don't know if you've ever seen that video on, tic I think it's on TikTok. The kid is like drinking a pitcher of eggs, like probably like 30, 40. And he's drinking them, he's drinking them, he gets half of them down and then he gags him back up and it, I think they were saying it was like the infinite egg glitch because he liked them so much that he had to enjoy it again but personally I'm not a big fan of that I've had it happen a couple times but no no sir the egg whites are definitely a better alternative plus you know it's just protein like there's really nothing else in there anyway I'm gonna finish my oatmeal have the rest of my little shake and then 
do some schoolwork and then it's on to meal number two. I'd count this as one meal. Yeah, meal number two. Some rice and chicken. Yes, sir. Ah, all right, there we go. Rice and chicken down the gullet. Um, watching some crash course. Um, I think I'm about ready. I've had, yeah, 200 grams of carbs. I've had... I had my, I've had 115 grams of protein today. So, you know, we're up. Anyway, time to go get some pre. All right, it's back day, God damn it! I'm excited because my last back day, I didn't have my pre with me. And I have, not only do I have my pre, but I brought my no salt today. And if you don't know about that, uh, it's pretty good. It's like just straight up potassium. So, you know, it's a good old electrolyte shock at the beginning of the workout to get all the juices moving right. I also take, you know, a good bit of salt as well. I'll do like I'll, I'll eyeball a gram. I usually don't do a whole gram because I like to put salt in like my oatmeal and stuff like that. But, um, yeah. I'm on the way to the LA Fitness. I'm going to see if they kick me out for doing this. But anyway, they got a lot of back machines there that are really cool. So kind of goofing around seeing what feels good oh wait 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 you gotta slam the pre so i'm doing that same pre i did yesterday um that riabolic so yeah but i need a oh that's what i was forgetting where did i put it You shouldn't multitask and drive. It's not very safe. Yeah, that looks like enough for me. lap pull down is my last part of my warm up and I'm just going down the stack. I'm gonna start it out on start it out on 70. Do like five reps, you know, whatever. Put it up for 110, then 120, and then get to that. My working set's usually around 160 to 170, depending on how I'm feeling. So we'll see. I forgot to press record, or like, I think when I clicked my headphones, it was connected and it messed it up or something. But, this warmed up, like, spammed, you know, what's it called, like 5 and 10, and then 15 as I went up. So, you know, classic. But, now, I'm gonna hit... My first working set, I guess, I'll just bust out the abs. I guess I warmed up the forearms enough. This one looks weird. The one vein like squirms up like a worm. My other arm, I don't do that.
Yeah. Do YouTube? I'm just doing it for fun. shirt i like that shirt um so <laughs> i had to bust up this trigger but i think i'm gonna put the camera right here this time can i see anything it's killing it. oh thank you all right ready to go again but I realized I forgot a secret ingredient that I mentioned earlier I just totally forgot this is like not how you should do it you should ideally do this with your free or even before when you do like that no song if you're doing what I'm doing So, that should be a little bit extra pun in the, you know, next couple of times, hopefully. Thank <laughs> you. 
Don't you go left, man. Just don't do it. It's not even fun. Anyway. Let me grab that machine. It's open. Alright. So this thing's cool because it's like the pod racer from Star Wars.
I thought that was annoying. God, that thing was just like clicking <coughs> on my damn headphones because I was shaking. Ah, oh, let's go. done this one. I actually don't even know if I have ever done this one. I feel like I, yeah. I guess I was just I was using these handles. I used to do this thing where I would, I have the angles 90s grip and I would sit down and pull on like that, but like, why? I'll do that actually, hold on, let's be scientific.
one day I start a 45. Oh, <laughs> it's high. I'm starting to think that I needed to drink a intro workout something. Like, I finished that Gatorade when I was walking in the door, but that was like, shoot, let me see. Damn, that was like over an hour ago. You know what? I think I am going to do that thing. I haven't busted these out. Probably like a year. I don't know. It's probably been like six months. As you can tell, I, it seems like I used to be super hyper fixated on being optimal, but you know, you kind of figure out that it's good to mix it up when you want. The one thing I remember about these though, there's not like, there's like not really a way to put your straps on. I guess maybe like this. And clearly, you can do this with a D handle too. Um, 
Oops. Little nip slip. Um, anyway. I think... Two more of that. I'm gonna add on another plate. But... Yeah, I think after... After this, I'm gonna do some... Pull downs. Oh, excuse me, single arm pull downs. And then. Um, some cats. Because they're still hurting and they're just stretching out. So. track that's why I sometimes don't want to do single arm stuff because I don't know like it just hurts I mean it hurts what it just <laughs> it hurts the count it hurts my brain this track but like you know each side anyway this I won't want to record for 20 minutes I'm gonna have to chop this up now
Uh. Uh. All right. Oh. Mm. 
just gonna do one of these and then it's time to check the pump. Maybe. This room, this uh, this room does not have the best lighting, but well, who cares? I gotta be honest. Like, if you really rely on lighting, like, I don't care if I look like shit. You just saw what I did. So, all right, I got the stringer on <clears throat> here. The arms are not pumped too much. Mm -mm -mm -mm. <sighs> I don't know how to do that one. So. All right. <sighs> I'm feeling carbohydrated. If that means anything. <laughs> oh, I don't know. There's not really anything else to do for back like that. I don't know. <clears throat> How do you do that demon back shit? <sighs> I need to start hitting abs. Because you really just can't even see them. So yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna go smash calves, cause I just I never stretch. I only like if I'm gonna hit something, I'm gonna hit it, you know. So that's the plan. And then candy and protein time, cause I still don't have a carb drink. This is that calf machine I was talking about. I don't know why, but. This thing is just different.
guy. I'm, <clears throat> I'm in the car. But I don't have any protein. I screwed myself. I thought I had some in my backpack, but... Oh, wait. Oh, shoot. I'm dumb. I do. I have a little... In, uh, a little baggie. So... I was racing home to go get some food really fast. But now, the circumstances have changed according to me because it was here the whole time. I just was not thinking straight. Anyway, me and my little nerd gummies before, so, you know, not all bad. Ferocious back day. I I am wiped. I didn't even like I said. I was kind of worried about my back, but um, I had a ferocious intensity coming through my blood like nothing else, and I got it done. I could have gone a little bit harder, I think, on the uh, the standing. Or the, uh, what's it called? The barbell rows. But I just wanted to play it safe, you know, for now. Um, but the rest of tonight, all I'm worried about is getting food, getting, um, some school done, and more food. I'm going to swing by Kroger and grab one of those chocolate milks, I think. Those things are so OP. Um, but yeah, I think what's on the menu is some good old chicken and rice, baby. Unless, you know, the old parents made something good. But I don't think, I didn't hear anything. So... See, I got a mint chocolate chip protein shake today. I really like making it into ice cream, but you know, for the sake of the gains, I'll sacrifice a scoop to the water. It's got like chocolate chips in it though, so it's kind of hard to drink fast. But yeah, thanks for lifting with me today. That's about. That's about all I got for you. Unless I think of something else to say later. But tomorrow is arm day. So I'm going to do the eight hour arm workout. You know the drill, as always. And I'll see you later. All right. <laughs> I'm back in a different car. Um. I'm going to fucking Wendy's, motherfucker. Sorry for the French, but I'm hungry as hell. And when I got home, somebody had eaten the food that I had left out for myself. And all there was left was like a burger patty. So, you know, I ate that shit. It's probably only like 20 grams of protein though. So... I'm getting that spicy chicken sandwich. That's it. I don't really need any anything else. Maybe a frosty, but I just want to go to Kroger and get one of those chocolate milks. <laughs> um, but yeah. Welcome to Wendy's. I may help you. Hi. Uh, can I get? Just one spicy chicken sandwich. Oh, just a sandwich? Yep. All right. Anything else, sir? Uh, no thanks. One spicy. All right. Five eighty-two. Have a good one. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs>